Heart and Techie, Coronary Artery Anomalies Part 1, Introduction to Coronary Artery Anomalies Coronary abnormalities are among the most common congenital cardiac anomalies. Anomalous origin of coronary artery is associated with ischemia, ventricular arrhythmias, and sudden cardiac death, especially with exercise. Types of anomalous origins are nomenclature based upon the origin, osteum, course, immediate course. In normality the coronary anatomy consists of two to four ostea with arteries arising from the right and left sinuses of Volsalva at an orientation of 45 to 90 degrees from the aortic wall. Ok now we will show you some examples of coronary artery anomalies. This is a normal coronary artery, here we can see the right coronary artery originating from the right coronary cusp and left coronary artery from the left coronary cusp. Anomalous origin of the LCX from the RCA with a posterior, retroaortic, course, this is more commonly encountered than anomalous LCX from the right sinus of Valsalva. This an example of anomalous origin of the left main with an anterior propulmonic course. Here the left main is anomalously originated with a posterior that is retroaortic course. Anomalous origin of the left main, here the course is subpulmonic or intramyocardial course. Anomalous origin of the left main with an interarterial course that is between two great arteries. Here is an example of the anomalously originated right coronary artery with an interarterial course. What is the mechanism behind sudden cardiac death in patients with anomalous coronary arteries? The mechanism is thought to involve exceptional ischemia and malignant arrhythmia from compression of coronary artery between aorta and pulmonary artery, osteoocclusion during exertion, slip like orifice and acute angle takeoff or proximal segment occlusion due to intramural course in the aortic wall. Thank you, stay tuned with Heart and Techie, do like share and subscribe.